What is going on, everybody? Welcome to the podcast. We're going to go live here in just a second so you guys can see everybody. But for your information, the lineup going from top left to top right as we come into the frame. We got the beautiful, the handsome, the good looking. Wait, who is that? Uh Uh-huh. (laughs) <laughs> it's Goki. How you doing, Goki? Seven six two. How you doing, Goki? How you How you doing, baby? How you doing? Hey, hey, you looking mighty fine. You looking, you, you, you looking real good, Goki. I'm just saying. He's right here, I kiss you. What? Bro, buy the plane ticket. 
Come on, man. <laughs> 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 to my, this would be my right. Nope, no nope, other side. Well, no, his, his whatever. To my right, right here, I got Mike. That guy, Mike. How you doing? How's your Hi. day going, Mike? Doing great. I had a stream earlier today with yourself, and uh... I, I know, I was there. Probably I rated you tomorrow after I mow some grass, but I'm really Mose digging that cookie that Thomas is eating, and I want one. Is he frozen? Like that? Oh. Thomas, put it in my mouth. Open wide, big boy. <laughs> there, you're just jealous. Okay. <laughs> we just got this banned. Was, this was a family-friendly <laughs> channel before that. <laughs> I thought we declared last time. It, it, we're already past the time of PG-13. I said cook. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the podcast. I'll see you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Bye. Hey, good job, guys. Nah, I'm just fucking with you. All right, look. <laughs> <sighs> Down here, we got the cookie monster, Thomas. And Scout 45. How you doing, my man? How you What's doing? What's up, buddy? How are you? I'm doing mighty fine. What's up? What'd you what do did... today, Thomas? Uh, worked, man. Got that 8 to 5, man. Living eight the to dream. Five. Ooh, ouch. Ouch. Had some Had some Chick-fil-A for dinner and... <laughs> I don't envy. some cookies right now. Does I don't envy. you get an hour lunch? Uh, I, I do. But because oh. I work from home, it's... You no, know, might be two hours. Might be an hour and a half oh. early. <laughs> Well, it just depends on how long dinner takes or lunch takes to cook. Mm, mm, mm. Right below me, chilling. right here, we have the person that seems completely uninterested in life right now. <laughs> Nerd Boy TV, Travis. <laughs> now, what's up, guys? How's it going? <laughs> Just, just here to play a, play a go key in the beginning there. <laughs> yeah, no. How's it going? Stream, chat, eat. I was reading. I don't article. know why that oh. was funny. It wasn't even was... like good. I, like... Shut up! What do you mean it wasn't good? <laughs> Not a goddamn word came out of my mouth. I think that's the point. Fucking first. <sighs> All right, Gunny. <laughs> Hold on, and, and and to my, I hope this is pointing the right way here. Nope, it's not. Let's see. Wait, hey, I'm looking at Darren's stream. I just gotta wait. No, it isn't. You're right. Fuck on this side of me. Wait, wait. We need the intro voice though. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the stream podcast. On my left, ladies or my right, ladies and gentlemen, none hey, other. Put your hands together, ladies and gentlemen. Put on your clothes for Gunny. Hey! <laughs> no one else. I should have done that with the echo. Just, yeah, yeah. By the yeah, way, look, just gain in feedback from my chat. I don't see any extra hypeness. Just by the way. <laughs> oh, uh, well, now we. Mike well, screwed we lost, it up without we, we lost Mike. We lost Mike. Um, but that's okay. Destiny is going to be joining us as well. Ooh, but girl. oh, oh so but, we but Gunny. Yeah. Hey, how you doing? How you doing? How's your day I'm going? Good. That was pretty good. You know, I just sat with you for another nine hour patrol. I'm sorry oh. you had to do that. No, no, mm -hmm. it was actually mm -hmm. interesting. We had a lot of fun today. Yeah. And we had, we were with Mike, too. We'll, we'll talk about it after podcast, about how you really feel. Oh. I, 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 what? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I was with you on patrol today. It was so much fun. It was a good time. Yeah, I was thinking about it. I was thinking about it. I was thinking about it. So Thomas. before we get into the oh oh, oh there's oh, destiny oh, oh. there we go um, there we go hi. hey girl hey girl hi destiny I I, in the I'm house I'm all the way down here by myself as well so yeah, like, that mood lighting is just it's too good it's too good Ew, I'm it's below Thomas good mood lighting ah. it really is good mood lighting. I know. Can you Destiny come do my the light? Best to my lighting room? out of all of us, and she's 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 not a streamer. She has the best lighting out of all of us. 
the aesthetic feel of her room, you know? If we had, like, a DOJ streaming house, we would have to have Destiny as, like, the interior decorator of all the stream rooms. I like that. Can we make that happen? Is that in the budget? That actually sounds like a good idea. Coming up Q4 of 2021, right? The DOJ stream house? All right, let's make it happen. All like proceeds it. from this stream oh, go man. to you. <laughs> oh, wait, we got someone else joining? <gasps> My bitch. Oh. Hey, bitch. I, got, I guess we're going to eight. Oh, I, I got to do that. Have food. Hold on one. Hold oh, on God. One yeah. oh. to do this. I actually oh. didn't know this one was coming. Ashley. Surprise. Yeah, I knew she was coming. Surprise. I did yeah. not know. I did not. Motherfucker. <laughs> um, I think she has the same thing with her OBS picking up her cam. She yeah, has she to turn on yeah, OBS first, and I bet you she didn't. So now she's going to have to close out Streamlabs, which is probably what she did open first, so that she can open up OBS first and then open up Streamlabs. <sighs> there, there she, she is. goes. There, you there go. she goes. There oh, the great. Now Travis is sitting next to me. Man, she hey, did Travis. her eyelashes and everything. Look at that. So I above you, Johnny. Hey, really? fuck you, Travis. Because I just got off of work. <laughs> what? Fuck, Gunny. <laughs> wow. Hey, hey, calm down there, you two. I forgot you're on the other side of me. I have to pretend like you're on this side and not this side. So, so for everybody in the stream, today's topic for the podcast is going to be how to properly moisturize. I use gold. Wait, what? <laughs> Go oh, that's next week? <laughs> oh, sorry. That's that's next week. That's next week. That, my bad. My bad. What is this one? I, I'm Hold more on? of a baby oil. Oh, <laughs> this is how to join DOJ? Oh, that's my bad. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I heard I that. Was a week, I was one week off. That's shit. Shit happens. I had that already and everything. You know, I will say that there was a question. I want to know where Mike's, Mike's meat hmm. sticks are. <laughs> no, you don't. The fact that I just no, you now don't. Left team speak. Um, <laughs> group. <laughs> All right, so uh, after this podcast, but you not talk. Hey, so Darian, <laughs> I'm gonna need to see you in the staff please office. Please, please, staff. Can you please be in senior staff. Who, who in this channel or in this call here right now uh, is an FTO or has been an FTO in their career of DOJ? Uh, I was like a year and a half so ago. We didn't. We didn't ask. We just asked you to put your hand up. Shut the fuck up, Michael. All right, so bas basically all the important people. So, all right, so... <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> Motherfucking... You have Motherfucker. got to go. <laughs> all, right, all right, all right, Who is... Well, hold on. Keep your hands raised. Keep your hands raised for a second. Who has been an FTO lead? That's right. Drop hey, them hands, boys. Drop right. them hands. That's hey. right. Hey. Hey. Yeah, yeah, Travis. Here we go, G. Here we go. All right. I just wanted to flex there for a couple minutes. All right. I, I, I have a question. If I, I may say, question. if I may say, if I may say, I hate Travis. I, 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 make that clear. I, I have a question. Yeah. What's what's your question? Toxic. Uh. Um. Yeah. I was an FTO and I and I and I led trainings. So does okay. that count? No. 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 Okay. No, I, well, well, with a show of hands here, who was Listen. an FTO supervisor? Yeah. 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 Suck it. Yeah. Suck it, everyone. <laughs> what yeah. us can There's suck no it. flex here now. <laughs> we need to get Willie. No, that's here not a flex. <laughs> that only works we should if get, you get to raise listen, your hand and nobody on, else time does. Out. That is something I do want. We should get Nighthawk in here one night. I've seen him and he's hysterical, by the way. Uh... Good old Willie. <laughs> and then Ash so like, on to the topic uh, of how to join I DOJ. Like, hey, is next he... topic. So on to the topic of how to join DOJ. <laughs> Step number one. All right. Going through the list. What? Somebody oh. somebody wants to join DOJ. By destiny. By destiny. Oh, give me one second. <laughs> one. All right, Travis, we're going to need a little Go improv here. right here. We're going to need a little improv? Oh, yeah. man. Now, right. now um, okay, some background, some background. This is a question that is asked to anybody here that streams, that's in DOJ. This is a question that's asked every that's time average, you go live. Should I, should I ask four point seven six times a stream. Every time. Every time I press the go live button, I get asked, how do you join DOJ? And why did you join DOJ? Why did you join DOJ? 
Yeah. I love the voice. I, when did, when I get, I get asked here? that all the time. Anybody else? All right. All the time. You can hear me now. I also I yeah. can't hear you. I can't hear you. I, 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 I left join. Oh, nope. Now you're deafened. I'm I'm 15, but I'm really mature. Can I join? No. Okay. No. You have to be 16. All right. Well, what if I There's just no like talk to Polecat and get like a special <laughs> um a special story? Like I well, have like you know 200 what? people that subscribe to me on YouTube when you know I play. What? If GTA you can online. find a way to talk to Polecat, let me know. Okay. <laughs> True. I mean, I'm in his True. Discord. I'm like his biggest fan. Yes, we need to keep Travis doing this same thing. Do all the questions and do the follow-up questions that usually come after the answers. Please keep doing that because that's great. Is Polcat in the server? So, well, so just fair warning for the people watching that don't know. Everybody in here is either in DOJ or specifically in Destiny's case, was in DOJ and has gone through the process. Destiny. So and everybody, in, everybody in here has been through and been accepted through the process at any given point in time into DOJ. Fair warning, when I joined, it was 2017, and the recruitment process was a lot different. You think yes. it was easier or harder? Easier, uh, easier. It was okay. It was much easier to get in, and the restrictions were not as high. <clears throat> Destiny, how long? When you first joined DOJ, how long did you wait before you got your training? Oh, my training was done in like three days, not even. No, no, no. What do you mean? I thought you got out of your interview and went like straight into your training. That was me. Oh, I think that was Ashley. Ashley. I think Ashley. mine was like that was the Ashley. next day or something. Yeah. Now that's not possible. Now you have to wait 24 hours. So this is what I'm talking about where a lot of our experiences oh, yeah. are going to change um, as you go through the list. But, um, Goki, when did, first off, when did everybody in here join DOJ going from Goki over? When did you join Goki? 2018. February of 2018. February 2018. Okay. Yeah, fuck this up again. Hold on. Oh, Destiny uh, has no idea when she I have no, 2017 of some months. I don't you know. you probably joined a little bit after me, so yeah, probably like mm -hmm. November December of 2017. Yeah. I I joined um August 7th of 2017. <laughs> August 7th 2007. <laughs> I'm a little over three years now. Dang, Darian. I'm I'm an old man. What can I say? An old man. Damn, Darian, back out of the game with that gray hair. Damn, <laughs> Ashley, what did you join? Um, my situation, <laughs> situation is a little different. Situation, situation, what? Situation's okay, first time or second different. time? Damn. I mean, like... The first time I joined, it was back in August of 2019, and then January of this year. So. Why did you? You know, no, we'll, we'll get to that. We'll get to that after. All right. Mike, All right. Mike, Mike. June 9th, 2017. June 9th, 2017. Okay, okay. Oh, a little before. Yeah, oh, yeah, we were talking about this today, weren't we? Mm-hmm, yeah. We were, we were talking about you joined a little bit before me. Thomas, when did you join? I was January 1st of 2018. Jeez, man. Oh yeah, Travis, weren't you real in talk? before me? Oh, here I don't we go. think I was. I wasn't in before you. <laughs> real talk, I'm pretty sure it was like November of 2017 or December of 2017. December 2017. Okay, so a little bit after me. Travis has been here for a while. Yeah, he oh. has. I'm old. Yes, he is. He was a sergeant for like two years. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, true. I he, it, his name doesn't true. ring a bell as a sergeant. So. <laughs> Super true, by the way. And Gunny, you joined like two days ago. Um, <laughs> all right. <laughs> oh, baby, baby, Gunny over there. <laughs> oh. Welcome to our newest probationary when, when, civilian, when, Michael. When did you join? Can, can we just put a can we just put a name underneath me that just says the guy that we like to pick on? <laughs> when, yes, did you, when, 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 when did you I join, Gunny? I joined in June. I put my application in June 1st of this year. June 1st. Okay. Oh, so you are actually fairly new. So, so oh, baby. 
Okay. Talking only, only to the that. people that joined within a six month time frame <laughs> of when I joined in 2017. So, Mike, was it Goki? It was Travis. 18. I was 18. February 18. Thomas. You were January within 18. six months. Goki and Thomas, you too, right? Yeah, it was January 18th. Okay. So, sp speaking specifically to those four. How much has DOJ changed just overall oh, from then to now? Seriously. A lot. A lot. It, it's a blown lot. up. That's the biggest thing. It's crazy. Thing I, I, I can think of. It's crazy it's blown crazy, up. right? It got bloated. Not in a bad way. Just like there's a lot of... Back when I joined, it was like you'd be lucky if you could have one server going. You know, peak times, you might get one and a half, two servers going. But now we can have like three or four servers full at a time. Mm -hmm. um, True. Hell, when I joined, I think the there was only four servers. To the point where we, and one of them was a development server. So, yeah. um, and it, it's it's to the point now where we need to implement a queue system to get people in a server. Previous to that, it was like a server would have 20 out of like the 34, 32 people available and you'd be able to jump in when you want to. But that's how you could have 32 LEO and zero civs and at one point. Yeah. On, yeah. Mo on Monday night, we had four servers completely full with queues four servers completely full with and, queues. And that, that's also, that was also when i too, first too. joined when i first joined on a monday night there were no full servers and i mean to also to, be to fair as well perspective to put that in perspective minus this is just minus dispatchers most likely that is okay. 128 people currently live in a in a doj server doing some sort of role play which is crazy okay. For a role play community, in my opinion, I mean, I've been in a lot of role play communities, and you don't see 128 people. You see like maybe 30, 40, you know, on peak times. And even like a good segue, just kind of you mentioned comms. So like I've been full time comms this entire time, and I think we're on like our third different CAD since I've joined. And, and by by and far, <laughs> this is probably our best CAD we've had, and the most like customizable one we've had. But we're on the oh, third yeah. one. 100%. I think that first CAD we had, that first the main CAD, CAD bubble. the bubble CAD, it was, it was that nice one was bubbles good. Not, bubble's not meant for CADs. I built one on bubble, and it's not meant for CADs. But it's meant it was, for you to make like was, a fucking store. The amount that you could do with it was good. The only issues were that it was not implementable into the game. It no, didn't sure. sync. Was it, really it didn't sync. It didn't sync with the game, which no. is the difference between that <laughs> CAD and what makes this CAD more superior. But Jeremiah in chat. Better. I'm gonna read it in the little kid voice. Was Polcat in DOJ when you guys joined? Yeah. <laughs> Polcat's the founder oh, and director of the community. Anybody that joined DOJ at any point in time in its entire six to seven years of existence joined with Polcat as the director and owner of that. What are you doing, oh. Travis? Wait, Someone in chat that. said, Travis, can you button up your shirt, please? And to that question, no. I say, no. I just want to take some, it off. Uh, some, uh, I could, oh, no, I could my, take my it hair? off, but then, no, but then Jerry would get banned, uh, and I don't want to hear it. Uh, yeah, he he would not okay. stop calling me. I mean, no. today alone, he would not stop blowing up my phone. I could just imagine what would happen if I got his Ooh. Twitch account banned. Who? <laughs> He's just trying You're to find I've man. been with him all day. I don't think he's called you once. Oh, believe me. Believe me. Oh, I definitely Damn. called him. Darian's just sliding into your DMs, man. You just kind of respond. Me, or me and D talk Take pretty much every day. <laughs> pretty I, much I, every day. True. I, I called Destiny. But, she was still busy at work, so I called Travis. Yep. To be fair, I think me and Destiny oh, share Darian. So cool I think Travis I gets Darian more than I do. Yeah. Just what, saying. To what I'm hearing, oh, it's fucked up. It's not like you're gonna have to fight him. So what I'm hearing is that by hierarchy, Destiny. Travis is the side piece. I mean, he <laughs> has a bunny. Action. He has uh, a bunny. I have a bunny. And Destiny, I have a bird. How does this make you feel? Should I get the bunny? The bird yeah, bites me. He doesn't really want to, but I'll do it anyway. I have Bella. Small. Bella doesn't bite you. Oh, are we Bella doing pets does right not now? Bite me. My Bella claws the shit out of me. Because I will, I will oh win my. this. Darian, I will it's win a this freaking fight. French bulldog. I have, I have a dust bunny. Does that count? I have yes, a dog. You. A really cute dog. Okay. <laughs> I will win what this. type look, of dog? Look, look at Travis. Look at Travis. Look, 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 look. Uh, see, on. see, on. see. I told oh, you. Oh. I do want to say Travis's definition. I'll be right back. I'll be right back. He's so fluffy. 
Because oh Travis, Travis is over here in a collared is, shirt on top and a pair of sweatpants on the bottom. He is actually really fluffy. Like, bunnies are so soft. I didn't know how soft they were. You think, like, dogs are soft and cats are soft? Okay. Nothing is as soft as a bunny. I'm telling you that right now. Chinchillas are a lot softer. I w- I, my but, girl, my, you know... My, my girlfriend's <laughs> sister has chinchillas. Still not as soft as a bunny. Really? I'm telling you, like, they're, hmm. they're, 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 they're just so soft. <laughs> My precious. So, what's the bunny's name? Uh, his name is Bunny. <laughs> and here's oh, the thing. Wow. oh my know. God! No way. Are you ready? Are you ready? So here, Are you ready? Okay, his name was Jasper. I'm ready. Right? And Are you ready for this? I, I started naming him Bunny just because Bunny's easier to remember than Jasper. Aww, hi, puppy. <clears throat> over here, show and Yes. I don't know how yeah. we went from how did you join or how, how do you join DOJ to a bunny and puppy to, uh, stream. Yeah. But you know what? But you know what? I dig it. <laughs> it I, respe- I respect happy. it. I respect it. Okay. Uh, but anyways, back on topic. <laughs> Destiny. Because you've joined twice. And Ashley, you too. You've joined twice. Why did yes. you join? Why did you leave? And why did you join back? You go ahead, Ashley. You first. Passing it to you. No, because mine's more complicated than yours. Oh, boy. Well, then we'll start well, one at a time. Right, I'm going to okay. go put the dog away because he wants to go to sleep. That's what she said. <laughs> okay, well, the only reason I joined was because of this guy, Darian. So... Oh, no, it's wait, wait, that wait. guy, guy Darian. It's that guy, Darian. Guy, Darian. <laughs> I'm good with this guy, Darian. That, this uh, guy, Darian. That's, that's <laughs> more of a podcast. Wait, that's that guy, Mike. Wait, for me, you're pointing at Goki. So on your. Wait, let me see. Let me look at Darian's stream. Let me look at Darian's stream. Hold on, I'm dragging. Wait, so. I am pointing at Goki. What the fuck? Wait, wait, wait. So what did I miss? What did I miss? Hello? You got to Okay, well, that guy. You got to point to your bed to see me. All right. So why'd you join? Why'd you leave? And why'd you join back? Literally because of that guy. Just this whole square I'm not why right you there. Left. Hello? Well, no, you're not why I left. I left because I of work and school, and it was just boring. That's what I'm asking. That's all. I don't know. Because you know, I'm a parent. I don't want you guys fighting on stream. All right, that's, that's for later. <laughs> Children, stop. <laughs> okay, yes, Ashley's Dad. turn. Um. Okay, so I joined because I was looking for an RP community something that looked like a lot of fun so when i had searched i had found came across you know doj um so i had applied so i actually i had applied three times now i'm thinking about it first time i applied i had applied for um as an leo but i didn't God, have a computer you shut up mike <laughs> you don't want to see her yeah, leo mike. driving god damn <laughs> it's not that bad okay so anyways um I had applied and I didn't have a computer that could handle the 5M and, you know, DOJ files. So um, I had to unfortunately back out, but I got all the way up to the training part. So couldn't do that. So I had to wait another, I think it was like another year, maybe. Um, oh, no, no, no. It was like seven months later. I had bought a computer that could handle it. So I had applied. I got in. This was in August. Got in and I joined as a Civ. About a month and a half later, um, I was, I got into trouble pretty much, basically. I had shared a screenshot in my Discord, and at the time, I didn't know, but in that screenshot, there was a TeamSpeak link in the screenshots. So, I got in trouble for it, and I got suspended for 60 days. Yeah, I was like 60 days, so I had to wait until January to reapply because in December they didn't have civs open so I know I felt so dumb felt so dumb after I had gotten caught by IA so you know that's always fun so I reapplied back in January and I got back in so well you're you're back and better than ever luckily I'm not gonna leave anywhere so you're you're striving now though right you're enjoying yourself yes yes very much careful to what i post and what i say so it's kind of like a learning lesson i guess for everybody out there join doj do not share 
screenshots with important stuff in it. Because <laughs> you'll get in trouble, like I did. <laughs> Watch your shots. Yes. Very much so. So, so okay. So going from right to left here, what made you want to initially join DOJ? Was it... Was it the RP? Was it somebody in the community that you knew? Like at the time, the main the main people at the time when a majority of us joined were Polecat, Jeff, Bugs, Black Hollow, Yotlex, um, Siv Ryan. Those were like the names and faces. Rachel. Um, I didn't know any of them at the time. Honestly, Martin until, was like, not a I media member. Uh, I didn't know any of them at the time until I started like mm, like researching more about the community, and then I was like, oh, and I saw like YouTube videos. I was like, oh my god, this looks way more fun than I thought it would be. So after watching YouTube videos, I'm like, okay, I can definitely. This looks fun. So that's why I joined because it looked like a lot of fun, and it is fun. It is. It's a great community. I love it. You know, it's very very realistic, but it's also fun realistic. It's not like strict realistic, and it's not seriousness all the time so it, it's a lot of fun it's not very kiddie-ish okay so. goki what made you want to join doj was there like a driving <laughs> <laughs> was there like a driving factor for it we're just like you know what i'm bored googled rp communities and doj popped up actually i uh i had no idea what doj was when i applied at all. Never watched a video. Didn't know who Polecat was, Bugs. No one. Didn't know any of it. What I found out about it was my uh, my little brother was applying for it. And we used to do it like on console. Like we'd do like a little RP stuff on console like GTA Online, which was horrible. Because mm -hmm. you'd be chasing someone they just whip out an RPG and you're done. Psh, done. <laughs> <laughs> and there was no backup online at all. <laughs> but uh, he was like, hey man. He's like, I've watched a lot of these videos, you know, Polecat, blah, blah. I'm like, I don't know who that is, but cool. He's like, well, I'm going to apply to this, this community. He's like, you should apply with me. It's like, all right. So I applied and he applied. We both applied for Highway. I got accepted. He got denied. <laughs> and uh, I was like, I don't know if I'm going to go through this. Yeah, 100%. He, he got, I got accepted. He got denied. And uh, we did our applications like side by side. And like, I was like, oh, yeah, that's cool, whatever, you know. Not really side by side, but we're like on the phone. And, uh, you know, did the interview because uh, it was Reed what did my interview. He was the oh, sheriff at one point in time. Oh, he, was a, he, he was a lieutenant oh, when I joined. And um, so, like, I got in. I was like, I don't know what this is really about. And so I, like, read the, the whatever, the stuff what you got to do, did the exam and stuff. I got, like, a 99 on my exam and did the training. And uh, I asked my brother if he's going to rejoin. I was like, I'm just going to keep going. If you rejoin, you rejoin. And, you know, he never reapplied. But it's whatever. So like I did my first patrol. I remember like going doing my first patrol. My first patrol was before I even knew who Polecat was. It was in a code zero patrol. And they're like, I was a probie. And they're like, all probies leave. I'm like, what? Why oh, I gotta leave? And they're like, all probies you need to leave, blah blah. I'm like, well this is stupid. Why we gotta leave? It's like it's Polecat. I was like, I don't know who fuck Polecat is. I got kicked out, so I went to another <laughs> patrol and next thing you know, it's like Darian's a, a Among Us addiction. I was like Oh, this is fucking awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I was in highway for the longest time, got mass sergeant highway, and yeah, it was a good time. Then went to the Civ department. Good old Civ, man. Mm -hmm. Civ is the best, by the way. Just saying. We kind of already asked Destiny why she wanted mm -hmm. to join. So um so I guess that, that leads to me. What's up? Wish that Destiny would join back though. We were actually just yeah. before this having this conversation. <clears throat> maybe. Destiny? Maybe. Because now I have friends. So I maybe. You should, uh, you should, uh. Because now I have You know friends. what? Don't look at me like that. Oh, I'm looking at you like that. <laughs> I don't know if this is the right way on stream or not, but. <laughs> oh, I'm, oh, mine's right. I made sure. <laughs> Yeah, I think right you're there. supposed to be this way, but whatever. <laughs> so when I first joined DOJ, I knew exactly what I was joining, by the way. Um, I actually joined because of Jeff. Um, 
I I was really in when I was growing up. I was really into flight simulators. Like, I, I really wanted to be a pilot. Super invested. I I was even going to school for it. I was in a magnet program for my high school, and I I was in avionics and etc. And Jeff was a big pilot, so he was like. I, I had been watching him for years, right? And um, he started uploading these videos out of nowhere about about um, about uh, GTA Five role play. And I'm like, you know, I had just gotten Grand Theft Auto Five. I was getting out of Rainbow Six Siege, and I was like, man, I really need something else to play. Like this is Rainbow Six was just not working. It, this was Operation Health. If you know the Rainbow Six wow. Siege times, uh, this was Operation Health 2017. Okay, so this is how far back we're going back, and um, I was like, Nah, th this isn't working. So I, I, I looked for GTA 5. I had no idea who Bugs was. I had no idea who Polecat was. No Black Hollow, um, Yotlex, the, the whole Code Zero crew. No clue. No idea who they were. Um, I joined. I joined, went through the process, got accepted, first shot. That's actually something else I want to add. That that'll be the next thing. How many times did you guys apply? But um, but got in. Same thing as Goki. Uh, probably like my fourth day, I waited in queue. There was no queue, by the way. You joined the patrol server and you kept deleting the number and adding it back until a space opened, and then you pressed yep. enter. Yep. Yep. <laughs> yeah. And, and then you get the chat. There you, was you, you no get, queue system. There could be you, you thirty-two. Get, there could be thirty-two LEO. There could be seventy LEO. If there was a spot in the server, your ass got in. If you crashed, tough shit. Yeah. <laughs> or, or if your computer was crap and you had the black screen, the black loading <laughs> tough, screen. Yeah. Tough and, and then a, I, a staff member would be like, "Quit spamming the server." It's like, oh. The, Back, back then, nobody <laughs> nobody of today's DOJ will understand the frustration of finally, after like 30 minutes, connecting to the server and be like, oh Fuck, God. I'm server split! <laughs> <laughs> yep. and, that, and having, that, and having to yourself. wait another 10 to 30 minutes just to get into the patrol. People today will not understand in DOJ. Oh, I'm um, so glad I missed that part. Yeah, but I spent be. like 30 minutes getting into the server. I spawned into the HQ, got my car ready, got my uniform. I was ready to go, man. I was so happy. I had just completed my ride-alongs. I need all probationary units to leave patrol to make room for Code Zero. And I'm like, oh my fucking all god, units, dude. Get the fuck out. Ugh. What the hell is that? Who's Code Zero? <laughs> I'm like, Code who? You know, I didn't code zero. Time, I'm in the game. Why that's not I, hello? Code. And even back at that time, you had to be code zero certified as dispatch to even dispatch those servers. Oh True. God, really? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. You had to be code zero certified to dispatch for the dude. I'm telling you, DOJ has changed so much. So my ass got out. You know what they did? They were playing baseball. <laughs> I, got kicked, I got kicked out for them to play baseball. I was so mad when I I tell you I'll tell you what I was pissed but I got over it it's okay it's been three years so so yeah that that, that was why I joined I, I just wanted another GTA 5 I just wanted something new I had I had just bought Grand Theft Auto 5 um, for the PC and I just wanted something new and that was you know that was just what I tried and now, now I'm second in charge of the department. Now. Growing up, man. Growing up. He's such a big boy. Such a big that, boy now. Such a big boy. big boy, Darian. I, I remember when you was my team leader. You know you who was my team, my team leader? leader? You, was, you was my team leader. You know who was my team leader? Devon. Who's that? Oh, I can't wait to Oh, no? This. Really? Devon was my staff sergeant. Wow. And you, you, was, uh, you was DUI coordinator too, weren't you? Yeah, you know what? I got something for you. Hold on. Could I, I was DUI coordinator too. Wait, wait. You I, know, I got. We should make Ashley talk while we're waiting. Um, Mike, <laughs> Mike. It, it would be Mike. Yeah. Mike. So Ashley already said it. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna Never mind. Screw you, Ashley. Oh. Hi. About why? About why you joined? About why you joined? 
Um, like. YouTube videos. <laughs> about just Jeff Polcat. Any Watch any them. leading factor or just the YouTube? It looked fun. I mean, this was like back when DOJ video number six came out, and he's on like six hundred now. So oh, damn. Yeah. He's yeah. on like episode nine hundred and something. Six hundred, nine hundred. Just got flipped the six upside down. You have nine. There you go. Yeah, yeah there you go. What the fuck? <laughs> but and what the? When did the Amish guy get here? Oh, yeah. whoa, <laughs> whoa! That's the wrong set. I thought this was Amish mafia. My bad. Wrong. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck you doing up there? Whoa! <laughs> How you doing, big tax? But uh, what the fuck were we talking about? DOJ, why'd you join? <laughs> why'd you oh. join DOJ? Leading oh. factors. Oh, Stick with it. I, I it. promise uh, you, this won't be a long podcast. You can get back to your meat sticks after. Damn. I'm actually what? tired. I'm not hungry for meat sticks. I just had like four hamburgers. I'm, I'm, I'm good. Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, don't, don't look at me like that. <laughs> but, um... Fuck! Oh, I joined the OJ because it was. Quit getting me off Now he's thinking about the hamburgers. <laughs> <laughs> this I is know, a never ending so cycle. They were so <laughs> good. Those thick, juicy oh, beef patties. I Shut love up. meat sticks so much. <laughs> Gunny, um, this is what being the last people, Gunny. We're never, they're never gonna get to us because of Mike right here. Mike's gonna <laughs> string us along for three minutes. Alright, I actually had to explain why she joined twice. Alright, <laughs> alright, alright. Alright, because right. he's gonna talk about food. Thomas. Shit. Uh, Darian. Oh. So I started. Oh, here we go. Oh boy. I started doing Should we put some light boy. music in the background? I mean, we can. <laughs> Back in my days of 2013 uh, is when I started doing GTA roleplay. And then back in GTA 4, different community. Um, and then through that community, I met two lovely people, one by the name of Trey, who we know as Trey Plays Games, and one by the name of Scott, who we know as Haphazard TV. So I've known both of them for quite some time now. And then the end of 2017 was rolling around, and... I, I started looking for a new community because the one I was in for the years before that kind of started dwindling down. And I had I had Trey and, and, and Scott and some of the others, Reed, who I know we talked about earlier, Goki, and, and all of them, like on my ass, like, uh, yeah, uh, DOJ is opening in January. So <laughs> it's a very quick, you know, I had, a, I had an established friend group that was already here. And, uh, and they were very easy to convince me to come over here and come over as comms. Because at the time, I did not have a PC that was worth a shit. So... So oh, fun fact. Right that there. being said, go ahead and say it, Gunny, because I know what you're about to say. Nope, I'm gonna let Thomas since he's the one to say it. What am I saying? <laughs> so you long. don't have to I'm have a afraid. gaming PC to join DOJ. Oh, I wasn't gonna okay, play you take two. Take two. Yet. We're not plugging dispatch just yet. But if you don't have a PC, you can join join DOJ as a dispatcher. That, that's plugging the community, not that's dispatch. plugging as communications, because communications is the best. Don't let there anyone oh, dissuade you. Is Destiny holding oh. a baby? Yes. Yeah, the fuck? <laughs> Your little blank. She just threw the baby! And now we're on to... Now we're on to... Uh, the Godfather? We're on to Travis? Travis, why did you join? Yeah, well, uh, the community I was in the previously uh, with someone who not many of you will probably know, but Brian K was a member of the police totally department. I know him. You do? I don't, I don't. No, I don't. Oh, well, there you go. I so, know, uh, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> hold on. Thanks, Gunny. Port? Appreciate you interrupting my segment there. Oh, yeah. Uh, you're uh, okay, Gunny. So, was it the port guy? What? The port guy? That, was he in the port? OJ yeah, too? port. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was yeah? port. Oh, yeah. Yep. So, Brian K and I were in a different community. We were playing a game called 911 First Responders or uh, EM4. And, uh, great game. yeah, it was, a, it was a great game. We were in a, community called squad 55 which at the time was like the premier em4 community right you do you know about that thomas i do i almost joined that yeah so um i was kind of like the tech guru for squad 55 and they were starting to dwindle and i'm like man what should i do you know and brian's like i just joined this community about a month ago 
So uh, he gave me Polecat's link, and I watched Polecat's video a little bit, and I was like, "Oh, this looks kind of cool." But I never really played GTA prior to that. Like, I was, I never, I bought GTA to play, uh, you know, 5M. So did that. Um, as I, I loved it for a while. I'm not gonna lie, it was, it was, it was pretty fun. It was pretty fun to to get in there, and you can, you know, experience quite a bit of uh, different things. You get, you meet a lot of characters. I'll tell you that. Yeah. Gunny? Why did you join DOJ? <laughs> Leading factors, anything that stuck out? Yeah, yeah, so so I, on the other hand, was like Goki, who played some GTA, I think he said, like, you played on you played on the console, right? In the in the three in the three sixty lobbies and stuff or the Xbox One lobbies. You're muted by the way? Bitch, stop looking at me like that. Anyway, so um, I would play on there. This shit would suck. Um, I started watching Polecat Bugs. So, you know, that was the, the thing going around. I got a computer. I downloaded 5M. And I never applied right away. I was actually never to apply because I knew nothing of good role play. Like, nothing. So I played around on a public fair, server. Still doesn't. I hate you all. <laughs> anyway... So I played around on a public server. They started learning what, what different general rules were, metagaming, power gaming, all like I didn't know what these rules were. I'd never heard these words in my life. Um, and then finally they convinced me to apply for DOJ and I I ended up doing it. Uh, one of my friends was had just gotten in and I really enjoyed RPing, so I said, let's do it. But I can't say I didn't know who Polcat and them none of them where I did. Um but being the, the newer one here that's been through the newer process, it is a little bit tougher, I think, and a lot harder to get into now. Just make sure you read up on what you're supposed to. And if you don't get in the first time, apply again. Okay. So before we get to the actual question of how to join, in other words, tips and tricks, um, the only part I could talk about. I, I, I want to... <laughs> I want to also I I want I also want to like go over why we're saying all these things because they all do actually relate to how to join. There has to be a motivational factor behind you wanting to join. Because if there's not a motivational factor, yes. you're not going to put the effort that's required into creating the application to join. Is that am I pretty on par with that? Guys? Honestly, I would have to say a hundred percent because I don't and and I never because I again going back to why I never understood whitelist servers like I didn't understand why these things were a thing and I really I really did un start understanding it more as I was playing in public servers in 5M and you wanted to have those really good role play experiences and you couldn't because you had some Timmy 10 years old that wants to yeah, eat you, your car off the, the barium the, the barrier at uh what is it, Alhambra? The, Alhambra. the perm over there? Yeah. They just want to eat it off there at don't, 90 don't miles an hour. The novelty of it, because that you yeah, won't you won't exactly. get any enjoyment out of it. Don't you can't join DOJ just to say you join DOJ. Because at that if you just want to you, you can get it won't in. Last. But if you don't have the drive to stay there, you you'll you'll get removed from inactivity or uh, you know, a bunch of, of different reasons. You have to have a, a good reason like you want to play and don't make it I want to play with one person. Uh, whether they be a media member or whether they just, you know, are a friend of yours in the community, try to get to know other people in the community branch out. Because if you plan, example, if I if I join because of Darian, Destiny can relate to this. If if Darian's busy on Monday, Tuesday, and Friday, and those are the only days I can play, you're less likely to play because you want to play with Darian, and you're not going to get your hours in. You're not going to get to know other people. I'll say this: I've made a lot of friends in DOJ, and it's because I put myself out there and and put myself in like. Not awkward positions, but positions where I didn't know very many people, and I got to know the people that I enjoyed working with and, and, uh, and role playing with. I'll, I'll be just honest. Want to play with Paul Cat, please. <laughs> oh, here we go. Another another child. So, I'll it, be honest to, to to back that up. I literally, like I said, I joined. I joined because I had some friends, and they finally filled it out, and I I finally did it. But they haven't played in the server since I've joined, and I had a I by myself soul it didn't know a, i did not know a soul i think i met thomas on a scene one day that's how me and thomas really started like I, i'm pretty okay. sure that's exactly how we met that's exactly how we met. it was on a scene 
and we just kicked it off with each other. I, he's a hundred percent right on that. You cannot go just because your friend wants to play. Now, if your friend's twenty four seven, right there, fine. But if not, you you're gonna have to wing it. You're gonna have to learn how to to RP with other people you've never met or known or anything like that. So the the point that I was trying to make to the people sitting there like, okay, okay, yeah, this is all cool. Yeah, yeah, that's why you join. Nobody nobody cares. How do you join? This is important to, to know how to join because you're seeing the trend that people have when they're joining the community. You, you know what I mean? But um, I mean, with that... I'm I was, I was just going to tag on that, like, uh, because I, I've, I've, I've had people join, you know, chat like, oh, yeah, man, you know, I stream and, you know, I'm going to join DOJ to stream. That's, no, that's not oh, the right streaming. answer. I can yeah, tell I mean, you, no. I can tell you as the media administrator, if you're joining DOJ just to do content creation, it's not. That's, <laughs> Travis, that's Travis, not you're going to be disappointed. <laughs> you're going, you're going to be very disappointed. Very. You're gonna be very disappointed. I know. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> the what? I mean, let, let me, let me, no, 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 hold on. Let me, let me back that up because I think you're, I think he's wrong a little bit, to a point. And I, you and I, can't I, join DOJ for the sole purpose of wanting to stream DOJ. I will, yes, yeah, yes, it won't work. I will agree. Not. It won't well, you work. Can, if you, if you, it's a it, perk. Though. It, right, it's a perk, and it's something. But I, I do believe it's something to work towards. It's worth working like, towards, and it's like worth having as an ranks. ambition. But if you join for the right. sole reason of doing it, you're not going uh, to. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Yeah. That's pointless. I can agree with that. You're not going to last. Okay. I just want to clarify gonna... that there is a goal aspect that there are some, myself myself included at some point, was like, mm, maybe I could shoot for this spot. Who knows? So, Ashley, same thing. Like, to shoot for that spot, yes, to solely, uh, I'm a streamer, I'm just going to go in and get it, and not going to have it. So let's get straight to the point. How do you join DOJ? Goki. So anyway, you go to DOJRP.com. Okay, applications <laughs> open for the first of the month. We're 16 plus community. Have to have a legal copy of GTA 5. Unless you're a dispatcher. Okay, no. <laughs> Unless you're a dispatcher. Yeah. <laughs> no, no. So, so to clarify, I mean more tips. If you were joining, if you were oh. joining today... And you got to talk to yourself, knowing what you know now. What advice would you give on the application process? How, how many? How many times did you? How many times did you all apply before you got accepted? Is there anybody here over one? One time, and then you got accepted. Once, okay. So everybody here applied one time and got accepted. So well, th I mean, this is this is a good group sorry, of people to ask. This is, I this say, is a very I good group of people to ask. Recent, and the only reason I bring this up is because I actually failed my civ exam the first time. And I had to wait. No, no, no. 24 hours. Application. 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 I passed, Once you can get to the afterwards. interview, you kind of made it. You kind of, yeah. It's kind of hard no, to mess up know, on the it's interview. It's on you at that point. Yeah, like, it, it's yeah, kind of it's it's hard, hard to mess up not. on the interview, to be honest. Yeah. If we're being... Like, if you mess up on the interview, it's usually because you're nervous and you choke. Oh, I was 100 percent I mean, nervous. I've, I've got the perfect the answer for that. You know, for a tip, you know, when you're doing an application, not to like skip in front of anybody or whatever, but you think about it. If you really think about it, and I can re I can actually go, you know, in detail with this, about the only thing I can, but uh we're a role play community. And you know, you we always role play, you know, in depth role playing, or you know, we you know, for realism and stuff like that. So if, if we see an application that has a line here, three lines here, and just a bare minimum, so in the train of thought of looking at an application, is that the kind of RP you're going to bring to the community? Just bare minimum or if any? I so actually I mean, more for to, my... To, 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 to go on to onto that is basically is, you know, go in depth. That's the biggest tip I can give anybody. Yeah. And that's the only thing I would say is go in depth. Don't just bear them in there or half ass it. Go in depth because they're taking that consideration. Of, wow, this dude has got like he just went in detail. I mean, you don't have to like write a book, but like, wow, he went in detail. You know, yeah. so now now they're thinking when he gets in server, that's what he's going to do. I mean, that's that goes a long way. Yes, he wants to be here. Yes, 
and FTOs are also very good at sniffing out lies. So be entirely truthful, because yeah. yep. a, a, it's not hard to call you out on a lie, and B, even if you make it to the interview, that's when you'll choke, is when you're trying to cover your ass. Destiny. Tips to join DOJ. You've done it twice. Be and been accepted with both times. Be I mean, I don't know. It just have to be... Hmm. Ooh. Investigation you just have to me. take your time, make sure everything's nice and spelled nice and perfect. And yeah, that was pretty much it. Everything else they said, too. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, y'all talked before me, so everything I've you got, guys said, too. So 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 the rest of the the rest of the people are going to say their own points. So I'm only going to focus on one point, and this is probably the most important point for me because it's something that I even push very hard as an administrator to the members as well. Um, as as from an administrator of DOJ to to the members, if you let's say you like break a rule or something. And and I pull you aside and we're talking. You and me can have a one on one dialogue, and we we can we can go at it for for hours back and forth. But the second you lie to me, that's it. You lost everything. Same thing applies to the interview process. You can have the most detailed, like Nobel Prize, Academy Award winning book of an application. One lie in your application, it's all gone. All of it. The whole thing is and, gone. And don't think that lying in your application, if you get past the application stage, will not come back to bite you. Because your application is kept on file your entire tenure of DOJ. So if you get caught out in a lie, it it I don't want to say you'll get removed because that's the wrong way to think about it. But it could uh, be used against you in the court of DOJ. We had, we had, we actually uh -huh. had somebody, no names, obviously. We actually had somebody that had been here for, I'm not going to give too much specifics. So I'll say in between six and 12 months and ended up being terminated because they lied on their application six to 12 months ago. Mm -hmm. So just don't lie. Tell the truth. If you get denied because you told the truth, then maybe the community is not for you. Honestly, like that's my advice. Ashley, all you? Uh, I'm talking about advice, How right? Join. How to joining? join. Tips. Okay, yeah. so obviously what Goki said, as much effort as possible. Um, another thing is to have patience because if you don't have that patience to wait, the, it can take anywhere from the same day you apply all the way up to two weeks. So, um, fucking <laughs> Darren. <laughs> Patience and another thing, I would not put another application in. Do not put in multiple applications within the same month because that will get you an automatic denial. And I think sometimes they'll even suspend you or ban you. That's what I've been told. So Again. patience, much effort, and just just you know, wait it out. If you get accepted, if you don't, then try again next month. You know, put put a little bit more effort into that previous application. So that's all I've got to say about that. And that's Mike. true. I'll, I want to build a little bit on what Ashley said. Not too much because she did hit it on the nail. If you if you keep getting denied, but each month you put a little bit more effort in, eventually you're going to get accepted. Yeah, eventually. As long as that effort continues to raise throughout the months, right? Yep. And then they'll and then they'll see. Oh, okay. Well, maybe you know he's putting a little bit more effort in. So maybe he's understanding that we're looking at more effort than just the bare minimum. You know and that he's trying, you know, they, they see you trying, then they see that you really want to, you know, be in the, in the uh, server, so. Um, so. My I already had you covered, Travis, I already did it, I got you. Tips. But Thomas hasn't done any hydrates, if we could just make sure Thomas does his hydrates, that'd be great. What are you <laughs> eating, Mike? Yeah, I was, I was able to say, oh, you know, no, you're no, no, don't here ask that here's Mike eating on stream. <laughs> I you thought you just Nothing. finished saying that you had four cheeseburgers. Burgers, and that was That's a meat four steak. hours ago. Is it a meat, a meat steak? steak? 
The meat stick, no, isn't it? Lift your hands up. Lift your hands up. Are we smile. talking it, beef, pork? Mike, it is a, no, it is, it is a stick it of meat, isn't it? That is oh, a, oh, he went, that he is, went less girthier this time. <laughs> oh, that is no, a stick. Um, that is a, a stick, stick of meat. Okay, that is a yeah, stick of meat. The last one had more girth, man. <laughs> All right, if we could stop with the hydrogen, stop. I don't have that much water. Stop I with the close-ups, Mike. Mike, it has uh, meat sticks. I'm at, I'm at a sprite right All now. Right. Mike, so good. tips, tips. Yeah, at, fo try and focus on one because there's three people after you. But oh, yeah. tips and to join DOJ. Tips to join DOJ. Uh, what would you tell like somebody that's system. wanting to join? Effort in your application, hundred percent. I know it's probably already been said while I was out getting my meat stick, but <laughs> it, it, <laughs> but yes, quality. Make a good application. Make a good present. Make a good presentation. Put effort into your application. People, if you put two sentences for each question, you ain't gonna get accepted. So, plain and simple. Okay. I mean, I, um, I don't think there's really anything you could really add on that besides what we all had said. It's all good. Yeah. It's, all good. it's yeah. And like, there's there's more processes to the to, there's more processes yeah, to the joining. How many, can, 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 can we pause for one sec? How many hydrates do you have? What did you say? What did you say there? Time out. There's, more, there, there's, there's more, more processes. There's more processes to joining than just the application, though. Oh, I'm there's waiting. I'm waiting for my turn. There's okay, the interview. There's the evoc. Like the interview, the training. Yeah. yeah. We, 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 I was waiting for the evoc. So yeah. yeah. He's gonna, so I think he's gonna do the evoc. I, I think well, Mike, I mean, well, Mike was gonna do the evoc. The evoc, what you yeah, and, no. what me and you took. But, no, hold on, time out. Yeah, no, no, no. no. We're, we're gonna get to took, that. It, we're gonna get to different. that. I, we're gonna get to that. True. Well, that's my yeah. turn. Oh, I'll true. talk. <laughs> Yeah, be, no, no, he's right though. The evoc that I, I me know. and him took is very different than the one that you took. And mine, oh, yeah. if it's you're if you're if your easier. tire came this <laughs> much off the ground, take your ass back to the starting right. line. Right now. Listen, you're, you're not gonna, gonna get turn your ass around and get right back to the starting line. I saw that tire come this much off the Poor ground. Benny. Turn your I ass failed. around. My first training I failed and wanted to know what it was. Here's, my segment. here's the thing. The FTOs I'm going home. purposely trick you too. See, yeah. now the FTOs don't do that. They don't like they don't do that now. To, but they used to, they would go flooring over a wood or a dirt road. You know which one I'm talking about, Darian, right? They go over that dirt road and they go flying, and you're trying to keep up and you're like, I'm gonna chase, I'm doing it. Your tire everyone in the behind chat behind you sees that tire come up. I haven't taken the rock in the last probably two years all right thomas Yo. go ahead your turn tips. uh tips two tips i have two of them okay one of them don't put fluffy bullshit to make your application see long seem longer because they see right through that length doesn't always equal effort i don't care about the color of your dog My name's Spencer with the oh. Excuse well, me. Detail matters, though. It matters, but not when it doesn't isn't relevant. He's not and wrong. He's not wrong. And the other thing is to leverage your past experience. I my application. Leverage your past he, experience. What if you don't have past experience, Thomas? I wait. Wait. We can Travis voice that. Travis, that's your cue. Well. Kid voice? What if no, no, seriously, it's, Thomas. What if you don't have? What if you don't have past experience, though? It won't hurt you, but I feel like there's always—I don't want to say always, but there's always a way. Because I know, like for me, like my past experience was a little bit skewed because I was doing role play for four years, five years prior. But sometimes your real life experiences come in. Whether I know there's there's members that are in emergency services actually, or have some sort of roles outside of gaming. You know, like for me, even my scouting career helped me out. It's this different type of leadership aspects where I kind of think that's like almost like a job application. Like, why should we have you part of this community? What would make you a good fit for this community, really? Okay. Travis? Yeah, um, I feel like me and Darian, I hate to say it, I'm just going to pull it out because, you know, we can. Being FTO leads, we saw the front and oh, back shit. sides of um of 
of the applications, like uh, making the rules that people would follow when it came to grading applications, as well as actually doing it ourselves, um, sitting in with interviews and such. I would say two two biggest uh, tips I could give someone is one, don't be afraid. Don't be nervous. In the end, we're still people. We did 95% of us here still had to go through an application process, the same exact application process. You had to have an interview. You're just talking to someone. They're trying to get to know you to understand if you're going to be a good fit for our community. So don't be nervous. Don't think that you have to uh, impress them by any means. Be yourself um, within reason. Don't don't act a fool like I normally do because I would've, wouldn't have gotten in. But... Um, don't feel, don't be nervous. Don't feel like you have to uh, kiss ass, you know, like that to the um, to the interviewer. And then, like N Scout said, when it comes to the fluff, your application length does not mean that you will get accepted. You size isn't everything, is is what I'm going to say there. Um, you you need to have you have to have the detail where it counts, right? You could have the largest paragraph, but if you don't know how to use it then it's not going to do you any good all right it's not it's it's not it's not the size of the ocean it's the motion of the ocean <laughs> it's quality <laughs> oh heck yeah. I'm this conversation i can't now. believe he did that shit man it's the ocean <laughs> Did you really have to include the motion of the ocean? <laughs> oh that was the top yeah. of the cake. I had to. I had to. That was like the cherry on top. Just had to plop that on there real quick. Travis, you dirty bastard! <laughs> I can't breathe. God. Oh god, Mike killed it for me too. Oh, oh my god. All right, are you guys? Are you, all you old people right, done go talking ahead. about your, go, your past all you experience? older people? Go ahead, yeah, Gunny. Well, go I'm ahead, Gunny. Sure you new I will bitch. Say, <sighs> well, I mean, hey, this, this all right, next topic, anyway. right? Shut up, Thomas. So <laughs> I, I will. I will say this though, uh, and, and it's crazy. It's crazy. No matter now with me just applying or or what you guys been through as far as the application, like the beginning, very beginning processes, it's actually all the same. And it really hasn't changed much. Um, yeah. I, for one, and and I will admit this here, and I have no problem. When I did my application, I had somebody help me grammar check it because I suck at grammars, and I know that personally. And I actually, and this goes back to what you said about lying. I got asked that question in my interview if somebody had helped with with my application because there's you know the, after you do the app, you do your interview, and there's you know a few things you fill out. And they didn't notice the Grammys. We're totally different. And I told them, yeah. And everything was fine. And I, I really do believe that lying, if you were, if I was to lie and be like, no, no, I did that, that would have been it. I was gone. See you later. 100%. You'd been 100%. I, and they, I would have, know. They, would have, they would have dragged you out of there. I can tell you right now, me and Travis used to get pings every day. Hey, we got, a, we got an applicant lying on his application. What do you want us to do? I told worry, him, I'll, I said, be there, I'll be there in 30 seconds. You're so already here. <laughs> as, and I, as I told them, though, I said it was nobody, nobody that knew anything. They had no idea what they were reading. They were just helping me spell check everything because I suck at it. And this goes for anybody that has, you know, that's nervous for applying because they suck at. Well, I can't write full sentences. I do. I suck. I hate doing English papers. I put more effort into this application. And had somebody spell check it. Yes, I did. But I didn't lie about it, and I told them, and it was a routine. Okay, let's move to the next step. So I, I do agree, lying, I, I really do believe, is one of the biggest things that you got to stay away from. Um, getting into what I was going to get into that you guys already dabbled on was the EVOT course. Now, I joined, I joined right away as a CIV, but I did apply for Highway, which we know now, and I took the EVOT course. And I guarantee you... Everybody up here would have failed. When was the last time you took the EVOC course, uh, Goki? I see that face. When? The EVOC course? When was the last Actually, time you took like, it? Uh, Shake the new one? I want to say last month. Last mm -hmm. month. Liar. Yeah, my, because my I'm, an, I'm, an, I'm an FTA and I assist with training. So boom, Shit. in your face. So, but no, no, but real, real talk to you real quick too, because tra everyone, Travis was like, don't be nervous. Travis, I'm going to tell you, like, everybody in chat, I'm pretty sure is thinking that, that, shut up, 
every, you're going to be nervous, and it's okay. And if you are nervous, let them know. Because that will account for why your answers are taking longer. Or your voice, when you're nervous, your voice kind of does that, uh, that no, like, no, stuttering. No, no. Huh? What? what? I'm tell I'm in. I tell but, no, no, but seriously, you have like, yes, you have to get through that part. You have to get through being nervous and eventually you will. But I definitely think if you're on, I, again, if you're honest with the circumstances in front of you, you're going to be, you'll be fine. I'm not going to touch on the application because took you guys all touched on that, but we could get into the EVOC. Who has failed the EVOC course? Their first time. And what I is failed my course? I failed my EVOC course the first time. Did you? I failed. I, Have you taken a new one? You're muted, Travis. I failed my EVOC course the first time because when they were doing that little route through the dirt road, I caught air. Yep, and, and again to confirm, and they made my ass turn around instantly on the dirt road. They said, "All right, turn um, around." Yep. That's so, so the EVOC course has changed about three times in the last like three years. Have you taken their most recent one? I'm telling you, without without a shadow of a doubt, the the one that me and Darian took, I guarantee you, is ten times harder than the one you guys oh, have, yeah. you guys have taken. One hundred percent. Well, here's what I will say. I there was the big four of us in my EVOC training, and there was only one by the end of it. I, I'm telling I you, that's, don't know what to tell you, man. I don't know what to tell you. This one's harder. That would be the dropout rate. But when we changed it, I'm telling you, Gunny, when we changed it, the FTO, I was there when we changed it. And like previous to us changing it, yeah, that would happen. I asked Darian, there would be entire trainings where there everybody would be yeah. four everybody. recruits and everybody fails. They would get they wouldn't get past Evox 100%. because that it was they would all fail with you got three chances to not i guess i guess i can't yeah yeah. i guess because because back in the day and i and and i'm guilty of this too we were super strict about minor details in in the training guide it used to say that you could not that you could not have a certain amount of space between you and the vehicle in front of them in, in front of you so in the trainings i would ha i would tell them okay set up your vehicle I would say, okay, are you done setting up your vehicle? They would say, yes. I would say, okay, exit your vehicle. Travis is laughing because he knows exactly what I used to do. I would spawn a panto, which was about the size, which was about the size difference. I would spawn a panto, and if I could fit the panto in between your vehicle and the vehicle in front of you, you failed. You're out. Damn. I will say this. So, how many tries did you get in the EVOC course? Did you get like three. how many? How many? Three. Right, three. I, 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 you better pull. I you can't remember pull that if, car up within the next two tries. I don't and remember if we had three. I think we do have three. Do we have Johnny, three? Here, here's also so. what they did differently. At least my group. Okay. If there, there, there would be tops four recruits. Okay. Yeah, that's what we had. It was four. It was me okay, and three perfect. others. Four recruits, but there would be three FTOs. There'd be one in the front. Usually they put like two two recruits in front, an FTO, another recruit, and another FTO. And they were all recording and watching your tires at the exact moments because they've run this route. They knew when to look for it. So the, trust me, like there was no oh, getting away with well, it. So, so <laughs> oh, yeah, my, oh, yeah. my true, first attempt, true. my first like attempt. Hours learning that, that course, sorry to interrupt you. I you, like, you I, 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 good, if you're a keyboard warrior, you got real good at knowing when to break. Like, I don't want to go off on a tangent. Oh, I didn't do my to hell like no. Like a really advanced like tr training about a year and a half ago, and it was a lot of like dipping through alleys at high speed, and you got real good at just like knowing right at the tip of the 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 hill when to tap your brake just enough that you could turn your car, but not enough that you'd like come to a stop <laughs> or you'd spin your tires or you go sc screaming into a wall. Like you learn real quick. You know, so my first attempt, I. I don't know if you have you've seen the new one then, right, Travis? Yeah, yeah, I've I've seen them all. So so when you first enter and you go take that that corner, fuck that right up. Took all those cones right By up. By the way, don't go over specific details of the Evon. No, 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 like, no. Don't no, go no. over exact locations or anything. Yeah, yeah no, no, I just that but, first um, that first turn, yeah, I fucked yeah, up. I'm Alhambra, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we yeah, started yeah. Broker Duke's airport. <laughs> there was something so, else I was gonna ask. 
glad somebody picked so the up the old on ebook, that. which we can talk about because we don't do it anymore, went from the airfield in LS. Wait, wait, is that not it anymore? It's it's different now. It's oh. completely different. Yeah, are you That's sure you're hundred percent? The one that you and I took. Are completely different. You, exactly. you, I, 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 when I did mine, it wasn't that at all. Okay, yeah. mine so, ended on on Joshua. It doesn't do that. Yeah, anymore. no, 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 oh, oh, no. no. There was one now. There, there, you like version two was entirely in the city. Oh, you didn't okay. Even know so then we can. Okay, then we can talk about talk it. About, talk about version one. Talk about so version the one, one. Okay, the one I did is you start in SIA. You go the mm -hmm. whole way through the city, the whole way up one, up thirteen, straight when up. You get up there, like straight up strawberry, straight up code three. And when you get you up had there, to stop at lights. Don't no, you're gonna fail them. You had to stop at lights too. You had to slow down. To. If you, you didn't slow down, at, bro. If you didn't slow down at that light and it was red, you better turn your ass oh, around. Yeah. <laughs> slow your ass down. So, <laughs> all they had me do. So all they had me do. Was nah, we, Mike, you're going to fail three, people. But you, I'm not going to fail people. This is the old ways. Old ways. Yeah, they you definitely don't do that you, anymore. You had to change your sirens. You didn't have to slow down to come to a stop. Oh, yeah. If we didn't hear that you siren, had, woo! You, you, you had to change your sirens and all that shit going through intersections, <laughs> which I don't see anybody do it now. Anyways. And don't. Don't think that we weren't listening for that because we were Dude. on Discord the entire oh, time yeah. being like, uh, uh, recruit two. Car, number, blip, blip. car number three uh -huh. didn't hear a horn. Send yep. them back. <laughs> <laughs> you would get off you would get off Route 68, go down Route 68, go North Joshua, and this is where the fun part comes in. You would go Clothia <laughs> Road to Cassidy Trail and end Ooh. on US Route 1 by hook. Damn. That sounds like That's fun. the one I took. No, 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 no. Cassie Trail's got the. Evoc, you were proud of yourself. You're like, oh. Yeah. <laughs> you're, like, <laughs> you're like, damn, dude. Because especially on that dirt road wow. that paralleled the, the airfield. Hit the button. Yep. Boy. Like, Thank God that used to or not. Man, I, I, man uh, I'll tell you what. I almost assessors. failed. My first time taking the Evoc, I almost failed. I did the first route. I caught air right there on that dirt road uh, um, next to the Redwood Lice Track. Then on the second attempt, I caught air on that dirt road paralleling the airfield. And I was like, oh my fucking God, dude. I'm going to fail this class. You, I will tell you, I passed mine on the third attempt <coughs> by, by two seconds. Oh, yeah, you were timed too. Yeah. So I don't think we were timed. Time so, Travis, yeah, were we timed? No, time. we weren't timed because we followed the FTO. Yep. We were, oh, so really? we weren't yep. we weren't timed because you followed the FTO, so you could only complete it as fast as the FTO completed it. Well, obviously I won't go into details, but yeah, you're timed. And I I, I was two seconds away from failing. So when I did my EVOC course, I was on a laptop. With integrated graphics running 20 oh, FPS. <laughs> this guy. Dude, yo, that was an FTO lead. Hey, Darian? What's up? I, I have the perfect question to ask everyone to wrap it up. Okay. So let me know when we're ready. When we're ready. No, no, hit it, hit it. All I think right. we've kind of beaten the EVOC course. Because yeah. I, 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 I think we're getting close to <laughs> no, the area we, where we well, shouldn't be talking about it. You know we what have I mean? The course. Well, let's right. let's, let's just do one more thing before he, he says his closing then. Is that cool? What? Like, really why quick. don't we? Why don't we look through or ask and let if, if we didn't cover anything that anybody has a question on that we can answer. Sure. I mean, okay. I, all, all I have. Does was, anybody have? Ha does anybody in chat? There's 162 people watch, watching. By the way, thank you. D is there anybody in chat that has a question that we did not go over about how Perfect to join DOJ? Has. About how to join <laughs> DOJ. The process now let me be clear we will not be going over specifics of like mm -hmm. what <laughs> about what questions will be asked what the route is um we, we won't be going over specifics like that we are giving tips and tricks and we're and all the things that we're saying for like the evoc course and stuff like that is from three years ago and is not how they do it anymore 
So when I so when I say that when recruits didn't park their car correctly and one of the FTOs would drive down the road in a Bronco and hit them because they didn't position their car correctly, that doesn't happen anymore. <laughs> Somebody asked if your main if your main department is HP, can you go seven times? No, you have to be a civilian no. reserve. You are you are in your main department and your main department only. Why does SHP have so many ranks than other LEOs? SHP has the same amount of ranks same compared amount. to the other LEO departments. And actually, I think, actually, 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 I think PD's got Here's more. Here's why it looks like you have more. It's because there's named like for PD, for example, they have Sergeant 1, 2, and 3 rather than different named ranks. So they still have the same amount of ranks. They're just named differently. It's true, too. Yep. Can I use a gaming steering wheel? That oh would be Lord. between you and the game if it's Can if I your steering wheel is compatible with the game. Um, as long as oh, you have a, a valid a copy of GTA and you have the ability to function the game properly it, enough to complete the... The uh, exam, the in-game exam, then yes, you can join with your student. I actually, I actually do like this one, and I don't know who can answer this one. But can you ask for a private training? Uh, no. So there's no I, stipulations. To, no, well, you can. Well, well, back when I was an FTL lead, you could, if for for special yes. circumstances, there may be times where uh, there is a there is a caveat that says if you're unable to make a training in a certain period of time, reach out to an FTO. There might be one that might be able to do that for you, but. Don't think of that like, hey, I'm just going to have my own private training. That's not how it's going to go. 95% of the time, you're going to be par paired with other recruits 99. to uh, go through training. But if there's that 1% chance where you're in a weird time zone or um, someone has to make a special circumstance for you, you might be the only recruit in a training, possibly. So long story short, case-by-case -case basis. Yeah. Typically Mostly. speaking, no, you will not get a private training. No. So, so to directly answer the question, typically speaking, no. And then I think I see one more decent question. How do you guys, I think it was, how do you guys rank up? So how do you guys rank up? Well, that's not, that doesn't have to do yeah, with how you join. Number. So that, that would be a different DOJ related stream that we I would mean, answer a question like that. So what kind of covers the topic about, uh, and why, like how to join what? or why would you join or something like that? If, if you don't mind me adding it. Okay, go ahead. I mean, to me with my time in here, and like my first couple months in DOJ, I like came across like not to go into death, but I came across like some hardships. And that man over there, Darian, he probably don't remember, found out about it somehow and reached out to me personally and made sure I was good. So I mean, like, and it was it wasn't just him; it was a bunch of other people. And like that's why to me, like, I'll never go anywhere because it's a family base. Like we 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 care about one another. Yes. And I mean, that man over there prepared. took time out of his day to, hey, man, are you good? You need anything? You need to talk. Just to let you know I'm here. I'm like, I just joined. Like, he don't know who I am. And, now and, we're it's, and it's, I had so many people reach out to me like that, you know, just because I was coming across some hardships. I mean, that, that's, that's what you can get in DOJ when I don't see any other community do. And now uh, I'm spending I, I, I every other day that. to try to figure out how to get rid of them. So he just won't leave. To touch on that though, real quick too, because this is this is big that that all these other public services and some of these communities that that, that people are coming from, they, there's you know when you go to these other communities, they have their staffs and their admins and the servers, right? And they are non-approachable people. Like they got, I'm staff. That's it. This is how it is. Here it is. I promise it is not like that. I mean, I I, I was blown away by how approachable I could be with a staff member. In the and pretty much any one of them. Yeah, I was still nervous as shit talking to them when I first joined, but it they, it was so comfortable and, and so like they weren't like, oh, I'm staff, you're down here. Like it, we were same level. Like just just so you guys understand this, like what everyone's trying to talk about. Like there's no I'm here, you're here. Like we're here, but if I need to be here and you screw up, that's where this is. But it's it's such an it's just a welcoming community from staff from head all the way up to bottom. 
There's a couple more questions I think we should touch on real quick. I'll just go through real quick in your chat, Darian. What happens if you're inactive after after a successful interview? You are made aware that you have up to a certain date to complete your training. Uh, so you can be interviewed. Let's say you're going through something in real life where you can't do the you know training in the next two weeks. I believe it's 30 days or it's 60 days, days as of right now. I'm pretty uh, sure it's 30. To, so if after 30 days, if you still haven't completed your training at that time, then you'll have to reapply and join DOJ again. Next question was, how hard is it to apply for dispatch than other department? Um, just like any other department, applying is applying. Uh, I don't want to say it's the same across the board because there's a few departments where they have to be a little more selective with who they accept due to the the size of their roster. Um, but with within that, um, you, you can join dispatch just like you would any other department still by following the same you know tips and tricks that we gave you guys by uh filling out the uh form and going through the interview app process and then going through the training just like you would for for dispatch it isn't any different than it is for it's just not in game or leo except you're just not going to be in game correct by the way i was corrected it is 60 not 30 and 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 i will say when you're applying for the doj um your your department is only looked at to verify that that department is recruiting. Past that, your department that you choose has nothing to do with your application. I don't even think the application has anything specific to a department on it. You are I applying for the it. DOJ, not for the department. You're applying for the DOJ as a whole, as a community. So... So there is no difference between if you put communications or highway or sheriff. The only difference is if that department is hiring. That's it. Oh, right. But to clarify, if if I applied, like me, I applied for DOJ at Civ Department. My application covered all of DOJ, but my main department was going to be Civ. Like, that's what I was getting trained on. I think that's yeah, more yes. of That's why we could clarify the two differences. So, you are applying for two wrapping it up, would you agree? Yeah, yeah, I think we should start to wrap it up. We're at one thirty, and so, it is going on YouTube. Let's go. That yeah. So let's do this. Uh, let's. Uh, my, the question I came up was, what's the funniest thing in your mind that you you that happened to you in a training, whether you were part of it, you were an FTO, or uh, whether you were a recruit. Something funny that happened in the training that you can remember. I have I have two personally, but I'll wait. Oh, I have I have a couple. I mean, it's your, qu it's no, your no, question. No, no, no. You should let's, you should go with it. What's what's change yeah, it up? Please. Let's change let's, it up. Let's go from this side because we've been going top down the entire time. Let's start with Gunny and we'll work our way backwards. Yeah, yeah, that's what, that's so, what I was saying. So obviously, uh, you know, he hasn't been an FTO. Yeah, he but I went through the process. Um, I have a question before <laughs> yeah, we wrap yeah. it up. I have something. Okay, so I had a viewer um actually ask this. No. Way. Um, so they were Whoa. saying um if uh what 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 would be the consequences of say. Uh, a member recording a video and posting it to YouTube or Twitter or something. Ooh, Ooh, that's a Travis I can, that would be a can question for me and Travis. Yeah, yeah, yeah take yeah. it away, Travis. I'll take it away. I'll take it away. There yeah. is a phrase that is read to you when you join DOJ. If you get your, your if you get accepted into DOJ by the person that interviews you, says uh, you agree that you will not stream or record DOJ uh, for any reason uh, and put it publicly somewhere where like you're using it for your own personal gain you will not use doj for personal gain which means trying to get viewers on youtube twitch facebook gaming anything like that um they talk anything it's a phrase that you need to agree to to be even allowed into the community it's recorded it's put on file so we know that you agreed to it if you are in doj so if you join doj and you're not part of the doj media team working underneath me and darian and our the lovely uh, group that we have uh, in our coc um then you will most likely face some sort of punishment, such as an up to including termination uh, in your, your your position in DOJ. Now we have an issue though because Muppet did just respond to my chat saying he did not agree to that phase that phrase. I disagree. Oh, okay, Muppet. <laughs> I'm, sure a, I'm sure there's a recording saying I don't agree. Damn it. What's up, Muppet? Good by God. the way, you should join us on one of these podcasts. Yeah, I mean, but, um, okay. damn it, Muppet. But yeah, I, I mean, Ashley. At the end of the day, when it comes to things like that, um, speaking from a media perspective, uh, we look at we look at the the intent of it, right? Um, and ultimately, um, I I specifically try not to beat people down for things that that can most likely be solved just by talking to you. Um, so if if you if you didn't know, 
then I'm probably just going to talk to you. And as long as you agree to take it down, then there's not going to be an issue. Now, if you do it again, that's that that might be a different conversation. Where but, were you when I had my shit go down? See, this is exactly. Oh, it's time to turn now. I don't think I was involved in that one. I don't don't think I was involved in that one. So, uh, but yeah, but pretty much, but that's pretty much the answer to it. As long as there was no malicious intent. Now, now if your video is just completely malicious intent, it's super obvious, then yeah, you're, it's time to pack it up. And if you don't know the difference between the two, one is accidentally, like I record with OBS while I'm in server, but accidentally hitting stream instead of record and not know that I'm streaming. I mean, I'm more careful with it, but yeah, that would be accidental. Instead that, of, oh, I'm, I'm going to play. And, and they'll know. I, I, I'm just speaking from a, a member standpoint, not to be ballsy enough to try that, if that makes sense. Like, I, I, I know that you guys know what you're looking for, and I'm never going to just hit stream. Like, you can't get away with these things, neither. Like, just making sure we clear that, too. We we have a pretty good team of people in, within the media team um, and even out of the media team that that keep an eye on it and let us know. Um, the, bi- the biggest thing to understand in DOJ is everyone has their specialties. You know, you have different departments. Civ- civilian is really good with the civilian SOP. That's why they're in the civilian chain of command. And media team is the same thing. We're really good with what we do when it comes to the media side of things and the public side of things. We're, 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 we're seen as the public side of DOJ. So anything that has to do with the public view of DOJ usually goes through us somehow. What you guys right. are watching is a creation of the media team. I'm, I'm in the media team for DOJ. So oh, this no is... This is, this this is one. So Goki's in the media team. Um, but the media but team. to the question, oh, everybody oh, here but me and Gunny, uh, and, of course, and that's Destiny, me. and Destiny. So, All right. So, so to the question, funniest thing to happen connected oh, yes. to a training or to the or, FTO department? Or just interview. Yeah, just like so joining the in, in general. some way connected to the FTO department. Okay. Yeah. All right. So go ahead, so Gunny. Me, so for me, it was – so I joined – my main department is CIV, so that was what I got trained in right away. But it, it was 100% a CIV training um, where one of the FTOs, we were doing our RP thing, and they had a character that they were RPing as. And I, I can't go into details because it goes into the actual – what the training was, but – it was probably one of my the funniest things ever. He had this lady character, this big, big lady character, and it was probably it was something I actually always remember from one of my trainings, hundred percent. Um, when I did my Leo training, there was also um, we had to tase a taser suspect, learning how to use the taser, and uh, the ta- the 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 part of the FTO that was doing our FT, I think it was FTA. Um, their reaction to getting tased was probably one of the funniest things I've ever seen in my life. I wish I could actually have that on recording. Because it was probably the funniest thing I've ever seen in my life. I can't, I can't go into too much only because it involves the actual like scenario. So I don't know what we can touch on with that. So That's I'm going to leave that to you guys. All right. We'll, All we'll right. leave it at that. Travis, you're next. Yeah. Okay. So both of mine come from when I was an FTO lead. One of the jobs as an FTO lead is to, uh, at the time it was, to verify that new FTOs understood the... Uh, material that they were teaching as such FTO leads had to sit in on trainings and kind of do a, a, a QA session, make sure that, uh, you know, FTOs were following the proper training uh, guidelines, especially if it was a new FTO or an FTA trying to become an FTO. And uh, there was one time I got, just got so bored. I was, this is back when I think it was an F5 menu, uh, the old like default, not the default menu, but the the special menu you're not allowed to have anymore. And I was just scrolling through items and like props and there was one that said something about a ufo so i spawned it while we were at the airport and it was this massive thing that took up the entire los santos airport just spawned in the middle of this training and it was the funniest thing to hear this fto try to keep his composure as he's talking to these recruits and this uh ufo spawns on top of everyone (laughs) But the thing is, we can't delete it. We couldn't get rid of it. So he's like, just ignore it. Just ignore it. We had to restart the server to get rid of the UFO. <laughs> um, and then the second thing was uh, during a training exercise, um, I was I didn't have a character per se I was playing, 
but I was playing as a, uh, a health <laughs> nut. I got caught with a bag of white substance, and after about a 30-minute role play of them testing it and, and drug testing me, uh, it was just flour. And I, but I snorted it in front of them and everything, and uh, everyone had a great time thinking that I was getting high off cocaine. Next thing you know, it's just it's all natural flour. <laughs> Sounds painful. I just oh. got to point out, somebody in chat knows Darian so well. What they said, is? well, they, no, because somebody somebody asked about me, media team applications. It says, no, media team is closed. Darian said, apps will never open. Good luck with being media member in DOJ. Direct quote from Darian, by know, the way. I, I can say this for sure, knowing Darian, we will cover the media team on a future podcast. I promise you we will. There's enough of us in here. We will talk about the media team on a podcast. We're probably not going to cover it this one just because we need to wrap this Shit that one up. Yeah. Me and, me and, Ash, uh, me and, and to be clear, in the, in, so the podcast specific, <laughs> in the podcast specifically about the media team, I'll probably try and get um, a few more of the media staff members in here, like uh, Muppet Josh, things like that. Um, uh, Thomas. Funniest thing uh, to happen in any way connected to the um, the FTO department or trainings? I feel like mine's like underwhelming. The only times I did trainings were dispatch ones. Cause I, have to, so, I get to follow Travis's story too. But I'm also the biggest stickler um, for using the proper phonetic alphabets. Muppet said, I got to talk to my manager. Not people that call in, especially during <laughs> trainings, like, oh, F is flamingo and U is the unicorn. <laughs> like, just dumb shit that is nowhere remotely near, like, the NATO alphabet. And it just got on my nerves. That's about, that's about the funniest thing is the person that's, like, just totally butchered the fucking phonetic alphabet. But I don't, I don't have any good in game ones. So I really I did my training and that was it. And I had to uh, follow after Travis, and that's not fair. Sorry. <laughs> Mike. Funniest well, thing connected to the FTO department or interview? Well, let's oh, just sorry, sorry. Way. Funniest we, thing connected to the FTO department or training? We're not going to talk about interviews here. Yeah. So we'll put it this way. Two of you guys have been here as long as I have. My FTOs were... Adam, the old guy from Sheriff. I don't know if you remember him. He was a corporal. Um, Andrew, he was a sergeant. And Andrew L. And uh, we had Brew or Nick Brew. Damn, remember is him? An awesome, funny awesome guys. content creator. So My I FTO really that doing. was leading the pursuit up. Um, what was it? Up Cassie Trail. Rolled his car down into the river when he was supposed to be leading it. And it was pretty funny. So it was, he wasn't trying to do it. And the only other time, uh, nothing related to painting or anything, but the, the, the only other thing I can think of is in game, we had a scene where we talked about waffle stopping. It was funny. About what? Waffle stomping. All right. So. Ashley. Uh, Ashley. Funniest thing. Funny. Really? I don't. Oh. Were you ever an FTO? Were you ever an FTO? I'm No. Uh, oh. Okay. Um, if you don't have anything, you don't have anything. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, that's, that's fine. Actually, that's fine. That's fine, Ashley. It's fine. Oh, How come nothing funny happened? No, nothing funny happened with my training. Everyone Listen, was like, I talk with the NATO alphabet, it's fine. <laughs> my god. <laughs> Darian, so, what's the funniest thing that happened to you that you can remember? So, funniest thing that happened to me connected to the FTO department wasn't in training, um, but I was patrolling with Patrick, the current sheriff, and um, Alviano, the former, uh, what was he, through Charlie 3? Yeah, Sheriff Carl. Alviano. Yeah, the yeah, yeah. Patrick Patrick and Alviano and we were patrolling in server and we were in a pursuit and I was third in pursuit and there was like two cars behind me and obviously if I'm third two cars in front of me. And um all I hear is um server group revoked, server group assigned. And I'm like I'm like, who's messing with my tags? And and Patrick just goes 
Uh, let's see. Uh, no, no, senior trooper. No, no, that's it. It's good. He's an FTO lead. Uh, oh, F F FTO lead. Oh, you got FTO lead. I'm like, no, I didn't. Stop fucking with me. What, who, what tag got changed? He's like, he's like, no, dude, you got FTO lead. And, and by the way, for context, back then, nobody that was not a member of the COC had ever gotten FTO lead. Only a corporal or higher had ever gotten FTO lead up until this point. So me getting FTO lead at senior trooper, I, me me getting FTO lead at senior trooper, I thought was impossible. Just to just to make that clear, and um, and I'm like I'm like no 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 what what got changed what got changed? He's like no no dude you got FTO lead. I I slammed on my brakes in the middle of a pursuit. The car behind me almost hit me. I pulled oh, over. Shit to tab out to check if I had gotten FTO lead and I left the server right then and there on the side of the road mid pursuit to go talk to Jason who was the deputy director of the FTO department uh, at least DV your vehicle I don't remember if I DV'd my vehicle <laughs> to be honest I I was I was in such a rush to get out of that server I don't think I DV'd that vehicle don't <laughs> I don't think I don't think I did. The staff office of this. So so yeah. so yes, I stopped mid pursuit just because I got FTO lead to go talk to somebody because because I got it. I was just so excited. All right, Destiny. What about you? Ooh, should be good. I don't have anything funny. <laughs> I don't remember my first time. When I joined, I think I was with like four people, and then my second time I joined, I was all by myself, so that wasn't fun. But well, your first one wasn't going to be funny. You were doing it with Jason. They were experimenting <laughs> that new thing. Remember? Oh, what? Yeah. I got a handbook. They were experimenting right. a new process with her, with her class. Is that not how it was always going though? That was no, new. No, they were experimenting something new with you, so it wasn't going to be funny. They were being super serious. I mean, I had a good time. Like, I really enjoyed the four people that I, I had to role play with for all of that. But yeah, it really wasn't funny. And then second time, for some reason, I was all by myself, which really sucked. But we all want to, like I said, they everyone failed out of the e-box, so I, I can relate to being all alone. Goki. Funniest thing connected to the FTO. I'm sure he's got a few. Yeah, I've got, I've got two. Just one. Uh, oh, okay, two, two is fine. Two's I got fine. two. I got two. The, the, oh, quick one, the first, the first one's quick. But uh, the the first one was I was assisting Blaze. You guys remember Blaze? Yes, I was assisting I do the old Blaze. HP admin. Yep, mm -hmm. I was assisting him. He was leading the pack, and I was the F, the FTA in the middle. So there was two recruits in front of me. And we're going up there. This is the uh, the older one of the older uh, e Evoc courses. But he, we're going up there by the big sign, you know, off road by the Vinewood sign. Oh yeah, yeah. And um, you know that, that path gets all like really sketchy. Well, when he went to go left, he didn't go left. He went straight, and both the recruits followed him down <laughs> straight. <laughs> Straight down. <laughs> I was going to stop. I'm like, stop, 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 stop. Everybody stop. And everybody just kept going. I'm like. <laughs> Real wolf pack mentality. They go down yeah, on the They just like full send it off. They're them. going like, with him. Yeah. Right, right behind him. He went straight. Whee! And they went with him. <laughs> it was to say they failed that <laughs> Eva. The, 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 the second one was I got approval to get eight recruits in my oh, training God. class. Oh, and I, I was I was a sergeant. I was I was staff. I got someone. approval. I, I got approval. I, I, and uh, we had eight recruits. I think I had like four or five FTAs. And we did our training like it was like <laughs> this, this sounds stupid, but we did like uh, like it was like like basic. You know, like we were acting like we we're uh, <laughs> like DUI instructors. So like everybody got in. We got them by their cars and stuff. Whatever. <laughs> And I'm like, all right, maggots, you know, listen up. Oh, my name is Sergeant, blah, 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 blah. blah, blah. And then one, one guy was like laughing. I'm like, drop, give me 25. And he started doing push-ups and everything. And then some other guys were laughing. And one of my FTAs, he was like, he was like, all right, you three, we're going for a little run. Let's go. One, two, three. He starts running. <laughs> we got approval to do everything. Oh, fucking you. But, but it, was, it was so fun. Like, we, we had... 
we had a couple of FTL leads come in and just watch. And they, they were like, <laughs> that was so fun to watch. Yeah. <laughs> well, you would have that story, you know too. What, I mean, though, it, it was as, fun, you know? As an FTL lead, I can say sometimes you had to try a little cool things to spice things up that weren't part of the procedure. Because back then, they especially, trainings were like eight hours long. Oh, yeah. They were like six to eight. And now they're like two to four. So it's a little more bearable. But back more then, they really though. were six to eight hours long. So if you didn't throw in something cool or original like that, ugh, dude, it was just like, I don't know. You, yeah, you, you were just sitting there like struggling to get their attention. You, you know what I mean? But no, we build amazing relationships as FTOs <coughs> with recruits spending yeah you know, really did meet some awesome people in the FTO department. Yeah, my I think my my dispatch training was nine hours long. Who fucking did your dispatch training? Um, Jason. <laughs> oh, all right. They like were nine hours. They were experimenting a new system. Nine hours long. Listen, bro, so I got ADD. Long, I like did, my dispatch training. We yeah, didn't go in game. It's dispatching. Nine hours long. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry you had to go through that. Yeah. That's a little fun fact, but we're coming up on two hours here. So I think oh, we're going to... I have a question. We're going to start to wrap this up. Oh, we need to finish this up real quick. We're running out of Let's, tape back here. Does anybody have any final questions or comments? I think maybe maybe next week, maybe we should talk... Do you want to, do you want to discuss maybe what we can do next week, or do you want to keep that... Off what what should be next week? Yeah, let's just go thinking, and knock it out. What should be next week? I was thinking week? Maybe, maybe something like how we met each other, or how we've come across each other. Anybody? How need? all of us met each other. That's... Okay. I like that one. I like that okay. one. Okay. How I think that would just all... follow up with what we've done so far. How did, we, how did we all meet each other? That will be next that's... week's podcast. Awesome. And I'm going to tell you how I met Thomas is going to be hysterical. I and, actually remember. And, it. and we can probably go over remember. like like seen. interesting th like uh, interesting things that we've all done together. If yeah. if anybody has done anything interesting, <laughs> I think we all have. I, I'm pretty sure we all have at one point in time. Yes. Yes. <laughs> but I um, think, what does Chad think? They they like that idea. Yeah. Um, uh, chat, what do you guys think? I know chat, up. I know chat really wants to see a, um, how to join the, the media team. We will do that. It won't be next week though. Oh my God. It's... Can we see Polecat on the next one? <laughs> <laughs> I'll see myself out. Y'all have a good night. Is <laughs> <laughs> that better on that shore mic? Maybe we could talk about, uh, how we talked about the other day, me, Mike, and Goki. <laughs> oh shit. All right, well, thank you guys so much for watching this. 180. I love Travis just keeps us on track. <laughs> yeah. sure. I'm not trying to be sure. out here, Darian, but I feel like you're you're peaking at 187 viewers right now. Uh, yeah. We were at 193 like five minutes ago. Wow. Yeah, we got, we got we got 188 people here, and man, can I just say thank you guys so much for coming out to the podcast. I'm glad you guys are enjoying it, man. It means that it means that you guys find this interesting, and you this is information that you guys are actually interested in because it's not <laughs> DOJ. You know, we're not playing a game where it's 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 how many seven eight people here just talking. And, and you got, we we still got roughly 190 people here, watching, having a good time. I think the next one's gonna be a little longer. Too. It. Uh, the next one, no, how we met each other, and like, I don't, I don't think that will be no. longer. I I think that we'll probably ca uh, cap every podcast at about two hours, if I'm being Eight fair. Hours? Because, because don't forget, they're going up on YouTube. Yeah, that's true. Darian has to download it and then upload it. Yeah, that's true too. Yeah. So, do we want to so, start like we did last time, right to left? Will you find? So, it? We'll actually, let's start so, with Darian. <laughs> so yeah. Hey, thank you everybody that's in the stream. Uh, we actually have the same cast as last week, minus one person. But yeah. we're gonna. Yes, Michael Tricky Bish. Tricky. Oh, Michael. I, I know. That. Um, but with that being said, let's go. This time, bottom right, going up. Gunny, 
Oh, Gunny. me. Yeah. Gunny, so man. I'm Gunny. Gunny, I'm, you look, can look, find... I'm, I'm in the business of, of, of house cleaning, and I noticed your bed's not made. How can I? How can oh, I get in contact phone? with you to made. to help okay. you out? Don't worry. Okay. Don't worry though. Full disclosure: my bed's not made either. So I was gonna oh, yes, say God, you better so, not be so, talking so, over so, there, Darius. So, 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 oh, no. so, so don't worry. My bed, my bed is bed, made. My bed is most definitely not made. <laughs> so, my so couch. Before, before Destiny says anything, because I know she was going to. But, oh, I was. Gunny, Gunny, where can <laughs> we? Where can bed. we find you? At X Gunny on everything, Twitter, Instagram, How many eyes? two eyes, X two eyes, X G, -G U N I I I I, yes, on Twitter, Twitch, YouTube, Instagram, yep. TikTok, yep. Facebook yep. Gaming. Yep. Are you sure? <laughs> yep. All right. I don't right. use I will say this. Though. I don't use Facebook that much. But everywhere else you can find me, Snapchat, everything. It's all the same. X to you and I. I. Um, um yeah. Travis. I'm really I'm jealous of the shore mic. How do oh, I talk to you awesome. more about it? Where do I find you? Yeah, uh, uh, find me on TeamSpeak. Uh, <laughs> find me on TeamSpeak. <laughs> wow. Wow. Yeah, really? Yeah. I mean I, I don't stream very often, but when I do it's uh Nerdboy TV with a three in the place of an E. Um, just go to DOJRP.com slash media. You can see all of ours. Good plug. DOJRP.com forward slash media. That's true. You yeah. could do that. Thomas. It's on the fuckhead that doesn't have everything consistent. So <laughs> Twitch and TikTok are both NSCOUT45. What's Facebook, TikTok? it's a great app. You should try it sometime. Um, Facebook and Instagram are NSCOUT45Gaming. And then YouTube is NASCAR Scout 45. Weird. And tw and Twitter's DOJ underscore Thomas. Oh my god. The N is for NASCAR. Oh, what gave that away? Mike. My man. I never knew that. Um uh -oh. Where can I find Twitch? you? We're not gonna hear the end of this. Twitch that gun. Fuck you. Meatstick.com. That gun. Like, yep. <laughs> Do not go to that finish, guys <laughs> and girls. <laughs> All right, so, what's your Twitch, Mike? Oh, yeah. That guy, Mike, on Twitch. Instagram is that guy, Mike underscore gaming. And YouTube is that guy, Mike 1988. Ashley, how do we find you? Um, I'm on everything uh, besides Snapchat, of course. Um, TikTok, Twitter, YouTube. Instagram. And, no, and, and what, what's your handle? Oh what what's God. your handle? How do I how do I what? You That's cut out. Yeah. Southland Ashley? You cut out by the way. You cut out. Couldn't hear oh, you. Oh, I'm sorry. Am I good? Am I solid now? Am I yeah, good? yeah, yeah. I hear you now. Yeah, yep. okay. Oh my god, okay. Just that's where you can find me. Um I'm muting myself. <laughs> Alright. It's so for those that didn't hear it, it's Southland Ashley. On all of her social medias, her her little kid is giving her a hard time. Destiny, and the dog, God dang it. And the dog. kid, and the dog, man. Aww. Wait, wait, you're <laughs> skipping yourself there. Uh, I'll uh, don't worry. Oh, I'll get best, back for to myself. best for laugh. Best for laugh. Destiny. Yo, what's up? You? I my Twitch is Ham Destiny with two Y's. That's right, two. Mm -hmm. My Twitter is the same thing, but it's got an underscore at the end. Under. Uh, I, do I have an Instagram with that name? I probably have an Instagram with that name, but I don't think I use it. You and yeah, that's it. pretty much it. All my other stuff is personal, so like Snapchat and yeah. Next. Hey, Wait, does Darian have your Snapchat? Because <laughs> if he does, I should probably have it. I'm just. <laughs> he does have Shut it. Shut your but... mouth, Travis. Goki. Go ahead. I mean. Hmm. Yo, Go ahead, Goki. Uh, it's Goki762, G-O-E-K-E, 762, at everything. Everything. Twitter. At everything? At everything. At yeah, Mixer? Keep oh, I'm other. sorry, low blow, Facebook, low blow, low blow. MySpace, everything. <laughs> Goki762. <laughs> Again, you're, you're in my top ten, man. Uh, move to Thomas. Messenger, Yahoo Messenger, everything. 
AOL. Everything. Yep, everything. 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 Oh my god. Barry Who Boogie, what's going on, man? Hey. And last but not least, myself, if you're watching. Oh that guy Darian.com for everything. It's all on there. Thank you. This is gonna end the podcast. Thank you so much, everybody that came out. I really I really appreciate it. Peeking out at I think the highest I saw was about midstream at about 203. So thank you everybody for coming out. Thank you for all the love. Thank you for all the support. Thank you for coming out, chilling, asking questions, interacting, and meeting myself and all the beautiful people that are here. You guys are insane. This will also be going up on YouTube, which you can check out by doing <laughs> XMH Point YouTube in the chat. I will see you guys uh, most likely tomorrow, depending on Destiny's schedule, for the sub-only live stream. What are you doing, Goki? Oh my god, what? <laughs> I am your father, Darian. <laughs> <laughs> I wondered why I'd never seen him before. Anyways, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. Go ahead, Travis. What are you gonna say? It explains why you guys are both so funny looking. Oh, oh. I mean, oh. I thought we were good looking. What you what you say? What you say, D? I'm sorry, Darren. I'm just kidding. I don't know about that. Darren, I'm sorry. All Darren. right. Any final final <laughs> comments to say? Um, Have a great night, guys. Yeah. Thanks Any for watching. final, final comments to say for the stream before we fully end it here? Any final things to say? We got about 30 seconds. I got nothing. I love you all. Thank you all for watching. Subscribe with Twitch Prime. Yes. Subscribe with Twitch Prime. That's my man right there. Where, where is he? Right Some here. Right here. Is That's what I'm over. talking about, bro. Subscribe with Twitch Prime. It's free! <laughs> Thank you guys Damn, so why you gotta yell? I know. I'll, I'll see you guys next time. Everything. I knew that would make them mad. So Bye. aggressive. I'm just a no to make you smile. And you need me to hold. And oh